Greetings, this is Mark Hoverson here in my office in Manville, North Dakota. And if you're watching this video, you're possibly thinking of joining Mana V and starting your MLM career. Now, I want to make this well worth your time and share with you a little bit. Now, if you're already in Mana V, you know, good for you. If you like it and you're doing well, stick with it. But if you haven't joined yet, I just want to share a couple things to consider. Um, this is a product called fruit of the now what it is is it's basically a kind of a on the coattails of monavi success costco sam's club walmart came out with a product that is about 17 dollars per bottle versus monavi's 14 dollars per bottle or um, about 40 dollars per bottle and the auric units are 3500 per ounce whereas monavi is at only a thousand and so some some claim that this is actually a superior product. However, you can manipulate the auric units units through adding vitamin E. So we don't know how much vitamin E has been added to that. But all that said, that's that's irrelevant. But it proves a very good point and something that's important for you to recognize in MLM if you're going to start an MLM business. This whole industry is about riding waves. Okay. These waves are usually three to five years long, and they're big waves. And if you get with a great company that has really good leadership, that, that wave can last a long, long, long time. Monavi has really good leadership, and I think is probably going to be a big business for a long time. But one thing that, that's already really hurting it and causing a slowdown in the wave is that the acai berry is no longer this exotic, rare thing. It's everywhere. You can go and Google acai juice and get acai juice everywhere. You see, at the time, Mana V was one of the only ones doing it, so the wave caught on big. And it's a great, I mean, I drink this. I like it. I like acai. But it's, it's in multivitamins now. It's everywhere. And so the wave is really going downhill. Now, what I have and what I'd like you to look into is something that you, in order to ride these waves, you've got to get in on the wave before it crashes. And how you find a wave, how you can detect if you're going to be in a wave, is is it a category creating product? Meaning, is it something new that no one else is doing? See, Mana V was new and no one else was really doing the drink. Fruit of Vita was its competition, but they didn't have the kind of uh, appeal and marketing and pay plan that Mana V had, and it was kind of the first big juice. It's the same thing that happens with Noni juice, same thing that happens with Zango. Zango has, if you're familiar with Zango, they have um, the mangosteen berry, and this is a product called Mango Zon, which is a really, a, I mean, third parties declare it, and you can do your own research, but a, a vastly superior product to mangosteen. And it's a knockoff. I'll give you one more illustration. Then you've got things like uh, drinkables. And what these things do is they have the acai, the noni berry. There's the acai right there. They have the acai, the pomegranate, the goji berry, the noni juice. They have everything in here. And what happens is network marketing companies made these things popular. And then the general public quickly created products around it which lowers the prices way down and the average American consumer just says, you know, I just can't validate staying on this stuff. So I'm going to just buy the cheap stuff. And that and that's why I have those bottles right there. However, if you have a product that is a category creator that the masses do not yet have, you will then have you'll be at the start of the wave. Now, better yet, if your product is very difficult for com comp com competition to even compete with, um, then you've got a residual income thing. And if it's product based and it can't be duplicated very easily, you're going to have a longer wave. So all that said, in the box below, you can put your name and email and check out a video report of mine that I have called, <clears throat> it's called Death of the Common Vitamin. And I want to show you how to ride a wave in MLM and be exposed to an opportunity with a publicly traded company that is brand new. Talk to you soon. Mark Overson.